start. I just want to pause this. And I also say yes, systems are green and I want to shut and I want to leave all these so then that way with fewer programs running the stream won't get interfered. That way then there won't be as much memory being used. Okay, systems are good. All right, so welcome to Imola, the Autodromo Enzo Edino Ferrari for B Fixed Fanatec GT3 Challenge. And I'm driving my Audi R8 LMS, got my Galaxy Air paint scheme. Yeah, Mario Kart. <laughs> so I qualified fifth out of 20 cars. I'm car number two out of 20. And yeah, the Audi, the Audi is a handful to drive. This thing is insane. This thing is insanely sideways at the start of a run. But once the tires get to temperature, the car actually seems to be pretty stable in terms of driving. But I feel the Audi. How bad is this for racing in the dark? <laughs> yeah, it's going to be chaos. I could tell you that. All right. So let's go ahead and jump on the track. I'm not going to put the Twitch mention up here because you know what they all. Yep, that's right, Carlos. All right, so let's go ahead and hop on the track. Leave it all out there. Nice and smooth. Let's get it all done all day long. I got a good feeling about today, guys. Just a quick reminder, you do have an in-car camera. Yeah, we put in plenty of fuel to finish the ride. Left side on the race. See, so, yeah, racing at night here at MLS, oh, so right it's going to be chaos in this race because I know some of these guys, I don't think, have a lot of nighttime racing experience. Me, I've raced in, at night a lot of times in real life and in the, in the video games. Only difference is, is that the night races that I ran in had the whole track illuminated. But in here, the track isn't illuminated. The only light that can be given is from the cars, the headlights, and brake lights. I'll just try to stay try to stay back a safe distance from these guys. But I just hope these guys around me are going to be smart and use their heads. Was a, see, I knew that wasn't. I knew that wasn't gonna be. So I knew that wasn't. I knew that wasn't gonna be pretty going through there. I knew something bad was gonna happen up there. That McLaren and Ferrari fighting against each other. I knew something crazy. I knew something bad was gonna happen. So. I knew something crazy was going to happen, so... Yeah, it's my fault. Sorry, man. I thought I was pulling up for a bit, yeah, just captured. Sorry, man.
There goes Dylan. Oh no. C and I are having a pretty good battle for third. car go back by me because I knew that he was going to try to I knew he was going to try to do a late break bonsai move going into Variante Alta there so I, I let him go back by you know I think he could actually take the lead from the leader you know I think Austin in front of me could actually take the lead so Mike went a little wide there. We give Austin an opportunity to get the lead. How maybe can mess mess with those guys up there? four-way fight for the lead here.
miles off the road. Whoa, what a save. Al about nearly lost it there. Of course, the clutch takes so long to engage in these cars. Okay. All right. Uh, car just had to get loose. Let me just back out of it. Okay. Dang it, car spun. Yep, no problem. That was not. All right. Man, a car just had to get loose. You know, I was trying to brake in time before going into the corner there to try to stay on the 10's rear. But darn it. <laughs> All right, well, I'll have to try again later. I'll have to try again in a couple hours. Yeah, the car just had to get loose and spin. That's one of the downsides of the Audi in this game, is the car just gets so loose under braking. Alright, well, I'll see if I can make up some lost ground. See if I can try to maybe move up a couple spots here. Had to force it right there. But wait, one more turn. On oh, fucking necessary. Jeez. Ah, 
hard to get loose. Saved it though, which was awesome. Just gotta watch out for the guy behind me. Yeah, I'm just trying to see if I can catch that car ahead of me, so. Yeah, I'm gonna have to try this race again later. Man, I thought I could do this in one try, but guess not. Gotta watch out for this Ferrari, because it's gonna try to pin me down here. Yeah, it wouldn't try out breaking me in the corner there, dude. Whoa, there. man, leave some space for God's sakes. Jeez, come on, stop pinching me. Clear. All right. Well, let's get that Ferrari back. Man, this is not going good. I'm gonna have to try again later. Man, I'm so oh my God! I'm back on the track like that. I don't think weaving is gonna do you any good because I'm gonna be on you like a heat seeking missile. This car is this car is just so twitchy. Watch out, guys. Watch out, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Got a car going the wrong direction. Earl, get these fucking cars out of the way. I'm on it. Thank you. Yep. Watch out, guys. Man! Alright, I need... I'm gonna need to try again later. For now, I'm just gonna finish the race, and then I'll try again in the next one. Well, that's gonna hurt. Well, this is gonna hurt me in terms of wanting to get back to my non-racing games. But I'll try again in the next one. Yeah, the car is pretty much dead. The car is pretty much quit on me. I gotta get all that crap off my tires. And I need to calm. Yeah, I, I gotta calm down. Yeah, I was having a great run too, and then. White flag. Just one more lap, and then this torture will be done. And I'll try again in the next one, which is just about an hour and a half from now. I never know. I mean, somebody. Come on, man.
Clear. Oh, that was close. <laughs> Avoided him there. Good lord, Mike. What a... That's all I... Checkers, P13. Would have finished P4 or better. Uh, if only I had, if only the car would have just stayed stuck to the road there at Variante Alta. Car just had to bottom out there, going th going over the little curbs there. All right, well, gonna try again in the next one. So, see you guys in the next one. <laughs>